Hello, beautiful people of the internet. My name is Ryan and welcome to the October 2021 monthly channel update video here on YouTube about our YouTube channel. Let's do this. These videos, if you've never seen them before, are where I, all in one take without making any mistakes, this is definitely not the second time that I've filmed a part of this video, uh, without making any mistakes, these videos are where I just kind of give you a really low key, really, um, sort of off the cuff i have some notes prepared but it's also just sort of like it's not a script it's just uh or an outline kind of off the cuff talk to you about what's going on uh in my brain with the youtube channel and what you can expect to see in the next 30 days or at this point 25 days um for this month so i'm just realizing i forgot to add one thing to my list of things to talk about so remind me to talk about halloween here in a second <laughs> Uh, so hey, what are we gonna talk about this month? I got a couple things I'd love to talk about this month But first I hope that you guys are doing well. Thanks so much for watching this video uh, Yeah, sending love to you wherever you are. I hope that you're having a good start to the month And I hope that your finish is even better. Uh, hey, so let's talk about the last month first Because uh, that makes sense. Let's talk about the last month first. What happened in the last 30-ish days or whatever um, This one you may have noticed this already if you've watched some of the videos on the channel or if you just vaguely paid attention to the pace of what we're releasing on the channel very honestly last month kind of a slow one for me um the reason for that is that my wife and i took like a, a 12 13 day vacation um right at the end of september uh to celebrate one year of being married let's go she doesn't hate me yet let's go let's go um i'm trying to make it to year two you know we'll see um so far it's going really well uh so anyways we had that big vacation and that means during those those days obviously i'm not making anything to put out and that means in the 17 days of the month before um, that 13 day vacation, I'm prepping super hard just to kind of meet the the like self-assigned bare minimum of stuff that I would like to put out on the internet. Uh, you know, the, the, the bare minimum low bar that I would like to clear uh, every day on the internet. So um, yeah, it was sort of bare minimum. I streamed less than I have streamed since I began streaming, <laughs> but that's more so I've never had a vacation that took that much of a month. Um, so I'm not stressing that we're still streaming lots per day when we're actually here um, But I did want to talk about that because that was actually really interesting uh, and it was kind of really an interesting like proof point for um, This whole bare minimum idea So the bare minimum that I'm talking about here is my sort of bare minimum bare minimum goals I'm just gonna keep saying that phrase and I'm gonna keep tripping over it For streaming YouTube my life on the internet this little indigestion thing is put out one main playthrough video every single day that's our skyrim uh, video right now so i wanted to make sure i put out a skyrim video every day check that happened stream every day or at least almost every day that i'm at home and like able to stream from home we did that um then we did that in september sorry i got the burps i just ate some breakfast we did that we streamed uh usually honestly i'm streaming about two times a day most days um or at least one and a half times a day on average so that's fully checked um, and then the other part of that is chatting with anybody who like being making myself available to anybody who wants to chat when I'm not online or making videos um, in our discord if you've never this is a, as good a time as any for me to pimp it because I never pimp it if you've never hopped into our discard discord before there's a link down below in the comment in the description <laughs> um, and yeah we hang out there every day hop in there hop into the introduce yourself channel tell me what your username on, is on twitch so that I know who you are and uh and say hi and you can ask me questions we chat about all kinds of dumb things over there right now we're talking about the big um this morning we've been talking about the big internet security hacks uh internet security like leaks and hacks and stuff um that has been happening with all kinds of websites that we use every day including twitch.tv so that's what we've been just kind of talking with um anyways that bare minimum that has all worked really well this month september was kind of a, a test of like if that's my goal for putting out bare minimum, uh, can we do that even while also enjoying our lives and going on vacation sometimes and, and celebrating, you know, and <laughs> getting to go out west to the mountains and go hiking and away from the internet for 13 days at a time? Did it still work? It did. Spoiler, it did. It worked almost perfectly. There was one thing that did not work perfectly, and there is one change that I do need to make, and this gives me a good time to talk about it. Um, this change has been a long time coming on the channel, so I'm not I'm not bummed about this. This has been like this has been a car approaching from uh, at night with their headlights on for a very long time. I've been aware that it's coming. You know, I've been blinded by the light, uh, blinded by the light. Anyways, so 
since I originally started this channel here on YouTube, I have made it a goal of mine to, as a way to make the people who take time to comment in the comments below, as a way to make them feel heard, uh, it has been my goal to respond to every single comment that somebody leaves on a YouTube video. And until about three weeks ago, I had done that. Uh, that is not, was not going to last forever, right? I knew that when I started it. My goal was, at least, that at some, at some point in time that would become infeasible, unfeasible because we would have enough people chatting or we would have enough comments happening that it's just not worth it for me to do that. Um, I had thought of it, though. The reason I did it um, is, I was thinking about this the other day, is sort of like, in retrospect, I would call it like, you know, if you're a professor in college, right? You go to class, if you're a good professor in college, you go to class and you teach your class, right? And then you do a couple things after class is over. You hang around for anybody who wants to talk to you after class. If they want to make the effort to come all the way up to you and say hello and personally interact with you, if you're a good professor, in my opinion, and you don't have a crazy schedule, you're talking to that person. You're making them feel heard, even if it's just a like, I hear you, or if it's a more involved conversation about the topic for that day's class, whatever. Or if you're not doing that, or if you are doing that, you're also doing office hours. You're giving people time where if they want to come up and say something to you, you're there. You're a listening ear. You can say something, whatever. It's, a, it's an important part of actually having relationships with people on the internet, at least in my eyes. Um, that is really easy. After, after my maybe mildly entertaining classes that I put out for 30 minutes every day on Skyrim or whatever video, mildly entertaining and probably very non-informative classes that I put out, it's my goal to like be there for people who want to chat. I just punch my microphone. That was That's really easy when the class is like 30 people and maybe three people come up afterwards to talk to you. Um, now for better, for better, I would say, it's not for worse, for better, um, we are in a slightly different situation than that, um, which is really humbling, but it's less feasible. I'm, you know, when I wake up in the morning and I'm, I get my coffee, first thing I do is I sit down at the computer, I look at the comments from the last 30 days. Sorry, from the last, uh, from the last 24 hours. And uh, for the last many, many weeks, I've not been able to answer all those comments. And I've not really been able to pay them the, you know, I've been, I've been uh, not able to read everyone's comments because I'm spending too much time on certain comments, etc. So, hey, things change. Uh, I knew that that would happen at some point, and here we are. We have now, we've gotten there. So, what do we do now? The promise that I'm making is just gonna change. The promise that I'm making is no longer to respond to every comment, it is to read every comment. I think that that, I'll still respond to some, for sure. Um, I love responding to comments, it's one of my favorite things. But I do promise now to read every comment. That's more for me than it is for you guys, though. Like, that's more for me because I am sort of of the belief that paying really close, attuned attention to what's happening in the comments of your YouTube videos is as a creator is one of the ways to make sure that you still want to hang out in the comments every day is like uh is uh my attention does not hurt the comments and make them worse uh it makes them better and more habitable for me I would say um you guys are awesome you guys leave great comments it's very few and far between when I have to delete a comment or, or shadow ban somebody or whatever um but that is daily work that I want to do and I want to hang out with people and and make you feel heard. I want I want you to feel heard. I want you to be heard. So um, that's what I'm doing. That's the that's the change. Um, let's see if my notes have anything else on this uh, on this topic before we switch and start talking about uh, the other stuff. Because we're almost nine minutes in. Holy shit! My comments say that's the idea. Anyways, we'll experiment and adjust. Either way, key belief for me is that. They're individual humans in the comments, and I want to relate to them on an individual level. That's my goal. So, anyways, other than that, for the last month, what else has been going on? Well, thank you for asking. We finished It Takes Two. We finished releasing our playthrough of It Takes Two, which was awesome. We finished uh, releasing our pacifist Undertale run, also awesome. Uh, and we started releasing some Cuphead videos. We started releasing some Cuphead videos. More on that in a second. That's the last month. What's going on in the next 30 days or next 25 days? Let's do Skyrim first this month. Usually I'm doing it at the end. Um, for Skyrim, uh, yeah, the plan is to keep releasing 30 minute videos. There may be a couple things that change. I'm really happy with this new thing we've started doing, which is uh, I'm basically saying the first 30 minutes of every Skyrim video will be what you expect, which is like trying to explore new things, do new quests, new 
new stuff, exciting stuff, um, discovering new things. But if I have any sort of like inventory management or grindy stuff, I'm trying to hit level 100 in smithing and enchanting. If I'm trying to do any of that, I'll add it onto the end of the 30 minute, like past 30 minutes on a video. Um, I just recorded one of those yesterday morning. Um, and I think that works out really well. That, fe that feels really good for me. I have no idea how it feels for you guys, but idea being, if you don't want to see that grindy stuff, you still get your 30 minutes a day. If you do, you get a little extra stuff every day. I like that. Like, uh, I'm sure you guys wouldn't be as pressed about it as I am, but I like that because it makes me feel like I'm not, I'm not screwing anyone over. You know, I'm not compromising for anyone's, anyone's sake. Um, I'm still giving you guys what you guys would like. So I really like that. We'll see how it goes in the next 30 days, but so far, uh, I'm into that. I'm out of breath here. Give me two seconds to breathe. <sighs> um, what else on Skyrim? Yeah, we've been doing a lot of fun. I would, I would call them like smaller quests. We've been doing a lot of fun, smaller quests recently, but I've really enjoyed them. Um, yeah, and I, I don't know exactly what will change. I don't imagine maybe we'll be into the next DLC in the next 30 days, but I don't really frankly imagine that we will be. So maybe just good old Skyrim, good old progress. Uh, what else will be happening in the next 30 days? So as I mentioned earlier, Cuphead, we started releasing Cuphead videos. For now, that is actually on a pause. I think it will be back in probably before too long, Cuphead. Um, but I'll talk about why I paused it here in a second. I'm not thinking it'll be like a couple months. Maybe it will be. Probably it'll be a couple weeks and then we'll be back into Cuphead, back into vibing, back into dying a million freaking times to all these different bosses, back into realizing how bad I am at platformer freaking games and enjoying all of that rage along the way. Um, yeah, Cuphead is not done. We're just taking a small pause on it. Why are we taking a small pause on Cuphead? Thank you so much for asking. The reason is because I have decided to follow my heart recently. I was on vacation actually and I was like, had this weird urge got all this new pokemon news coming out with a new game coming out in november pokemon was probably my original gaming experience playing pokemon yellow on my game boy pocket i don't have my game boy pocket here but i do have my game boy advance here uh with my game boy crystal with my crystal um in it um so i have a lot of nostalgia for pokemon and i was on vacation and i was realizing like man i really have a strong desire to play pokemon right now and i mentioned it to people on stream and people were like, play freaking Pokemon. We're here. Let's do it. We used to stream Pokemon actually back in the day. Um, so that's what we're doing. We're playing Pokemon Soul Silver right now. Uh, we're a couple days into it as I, as you guys release this, as the, you guys see this video. Um, so we're doing that on stream instead of Cuphead right now. Cuphead will come back. But in the meantime, I think I'll put those Soul Silver videos out um, as well. So you guys should probably see just like a long, a long, very chill. I'm very slow. I'm no good at Pokemon. I just really enjoy it. Um, and so far it's been a ton of fun to stream because we all just talk about old video games. We talk about like nostalgia, talk about Pokemon. It's a good time. Um, so I'll put those videos out soon and you should check them out if you have any interest in that. That's about all I got for the next month. Um, and that's good because we're at 13 minutes. What else has changed? Uh, that's it. Uh, the first thing, we have new lighting. This lighting is different. Uh, I upgraded a couple pieces of equipment this week or this month, which is cool for me. Uh, I have a new non-broken boom arm, excitement, <laughs> and I have a new uh, a new light, um, and I took kind of uh, a couple days to kind of redo the lighting in here so that I stand out more from the background so that the lighting is a little bit better. Um, I'm still playing with it a little bit, but generally so far, I'm a fan um, of how it looks. So let me know if you if you like it, if you hate it, let me know one way or the other. Cool. Um, yeah, I think that's all I've got. Thanks so much for watching this video. That's our October update. I hope to come back. Nope. No, it's not. I forgot that I was going to mention something that is not on my list of outline things to talk about. If you are one of those people who really fucking loves Halloween and loves the fall vibes, loves all that shit. First off, that's great. I hope you enjoy this month very much. <laughs> Second off, uh, I don't know when exactly, but on Twitch, we are going to be streaming um, some different Halloween themed themed stuff um, this month. Uh, including we're going to do a costume party and uh, and carve some pumpkins. So if you want to know more about that, hop into the Discord and we'll, we'll talk about it soon. Uh, I should have details here next couple days probably. If you're not a person who enjoys fall and October and Halloween, that's cool too. Much love to you. No worries. <laughs>
All right, that's truly all that I got. I'll see you guys soon. Thanks so much for watching these videos. These are my favorite videos to make on the channel, probably. And uh, I hope that you guys enjoy watching them. So until then, I'll see you in a couple minutes with another Skyrim video. Let's be honest. Uh, yeah. Bye-bye.